Previously on The Walking Dead. What's your name? I'm Clementine. You've been all by yourself through this? I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. It's how the world works now! We are those bad people dead? I hope you know what you're doing with her. I got it! Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my mom and dad are. Clementina, I think it'd be safer for you to stay here with Omi. Clementine? Clementine! Oh. Oh. I know how to be a dad, you know. She wouldn't be exposed to what she has been with you. We... I saw my parents. Come here, sweet pea. You have to shoot me, honey. Lee, no! That don't mean it, Krista. One of the best things about this game is just overall the story and they use great music in it What do you think? Omid, you can't be serious. I am. We are not doing that. Why not? Because. 
Come on, Krista. What's wrong with Omid? We're not calling our baby Omid. One of you is enough. Clementine, a little help here? Omid the second. No. Omid Jr.? No. You have to admit it has a ring to it. Omid is a good name. I like it. Thank you, Clementine. You always agree with him. Because I'm always right. You're not taking this seriously. I take everything seriously. Especially the Lomid's future. Keep talking, and you'll be sleeping in the rain tonight. Remember that time in Barstow? Vegas weekend. Why don't you, uh, uh, get cleaned up in the girls' room, Clem? I hope the sink works in there. I wouldn't count on it. Just be careful and make sure to keep track of your things. We'll be right next door. Okay. Hello? I see you. Get out of there. You're not fooling me. Who are you? None of your business. Are you gonna hurt me? Only if you're stupid. Get out here. You got anything on you? Come on, let's see. No, that's all I have. That's it? How'd you make it this long? I'm serious, what else you got? That's it. Don't lie to me, I'll pop you. Give me what you got. I'm not screwing around, come on. 
I don't have anything. Give me that hat. No. Where'd you get it? I asked you a question. My dad gave it to me. Just give it to me. Junk, junk, junk. Look at all this junk. Shit, shit, and more shit. Why you ain't got nothing good? Not like the last people I got. They had all kinds of good shit. That was a good catch. You ain't got nothing good. You're just a little fish. You gonna cry, little fish? This your daddy? What a bozo. Bro, not on me either. Nah. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. Krista, talk to me. You're not pregnant. Not pregnant anymore. <sighs> Maybe since Omi died, she took pills or this will never work. Look at this. It's pathetic. The wood's too wet to burn more smoke than flame. At this rate, we'll be eating this for breakfast. What else can we do? Find something that'll burn, maybe. I don't know. Won't be easy in the dark and in the rain. You should be doing this, not me. Tending a fire so you can cook and stay warm. It's something you have to be able to do, Clementine. Otherwise... to find a group. People we can trust. We've been on our own for too long. Trust? You think you can trust someone out here? Not now. Not anymore. I'm freezing. You think this is bad? Wait till we get up to Wellington. Then talk to me about cold. If we yeah, make it. I got to the phone we still have a couple...
hard months ahead of us. This rain will turn to sleet, then ice, then snow. It won't be easy. Can we make it that far? Maybe. I don't know. We just need to keep moving north. We sure as hell can't stay here. I miss Lee. I'm sure you do. <sighs> now I'm gonna go look for more wood. You just keep the fire lit. Still not enough. The flames are too low. This might burn. You think you're fooling here? Give us the truth and you don't get hurt! You fucking with me? Where's the rest of your group? I, I'm by myself! Bullshit! She's lying! Cut the shit, lady! It's it's just me! Come on, guys! Look at that. Krista, run! Hey! Run! 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 Fucking around! Ah. 
Alright then, so the first of season 2 is an, an intense season 2. First episode is very intense. So far. I think Chris is probably dead. From what we've seen. I heard a gunshot. So. Krista, are you there? Oh, okay, it's this button. It's just the button. It's okay, boy. It's okay. <laughs> okay, you don't like that. Got it. Sorry. <laughs> What's he doing? What'd you find, boy? Where are you going? Wait up! Hmm. 
looks pretty run over, but you never know. Let's look around for some food. Looks like they were a happy family once. I hope they left some food behind somewhere. Hmm, nothing edible. Wanna play? Wanna play catch? <coughs> okay, bring it back. Good boy, good boy. Wanna go again? this. I sure do. Let's go one more time. Go get it, boy. Darn. It was good while it lasted, though, right? Yeah, you're right. Shouldn't waste the energy anyway. Boy, what's the matter? Shh, we have to be quiet. It's okay, he's dead. Look, you can see the bite. Looks like he tried to cut it out. That never works. Ever. It's okay. We're smart and he's not. We're smarter than all of them. Okay. Stay out of their reach. I like to think that if they were alive, they'd probably want to help you. Nothing. <sighs> Still pretty sharp. 
At least we found something useful. We won't go another night without food, okay? <sighs> no food here, either. Empty. Better keep looking, boy. It's not much of a tent anymore. I bet scavengers tore it apart. Think anyone's been sleeping in here? I can't tell. Maybe we better not wait around to find out. inside. Please don't be bad. I guess you're pretty hungry, too. Here you go. Hey, you don't eat it all!
Come on, kid. We gotta get him. I think... I think we're safe. Yeah. Yeah, we're good. Hey, you alright? I can walk. Oh, was that so? Because last time I saw you, you could barely crawl away from that lurker back there. Look, you're in bad shape, kid. What are you doing out here? Where are the, uh, the people you're with? There's no chance you made it this long on your own. I don't want them thinking we're doing anything but trying to help you. My friend and I got attacked. Hmm. These folks mentioned what they were after? They might have just wanted food. We were cooking some sort of weasel. They attacked you for a weasel? Damn. That is low. They didn't mention any names, right? They weren't searching for anybody? Well, I'm Luke, and this is Pete. Hey there. Hi. I'm Clementine. It's nice to meet you, Clementine. Now for now, we're gonna take you back to our group. Okay, we got a doctor with us, and you look like you could use some- Oh, shit! <laughs> what? What is it? She's- She's been bit, man. Fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. What are we gonna do here? No, it was a dog. I didn't see any dog, Clementine. Come on, kid. We just saw you with those lurkers back there. No, it really was a dog. Please, believe me. Look, I want to, kid, but I gotta believe my own two eyes first, and I didn't see no dog around. No, it was from before. Hmm, all right. Let's see it. Whoa, 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 hey, watch yourself. Hey, don't look at me like that. You're the one that's bit here, okay? Uh, is it like she says? Well, it could be a dog. Hard to say. So where'd this dog go? The one that did this. What? What does that matter, Pete? Seriously. I... I killed it. What? Really? A dog shows up and bites you and you just kill it? What would you have done? I don't know. It attacked me. Still, you don't... You don't kill dogs. Clementine? Yes? You telling us the truth? You look me in the eyes when you answer. Yes. All right, Clementine. That's good enough for me. Well, what else was she gonna say? I've got a good bullshit detector, Luke. That's why you can never beat me at poker. <laughs> you don't always beat me at... All right, how can you be sure? Well, I'm sure I ain't willing to leave a little girl in the woods to die when we got a doctor with us that can make a call. We can have Carlos take a look at it first. Nick ain't gonna like this. Not with what happened. You don't have to remind me of that, boy. Right. Sorry, sir. Come on. Clementine, are you feeling all right? I'm fine. Just tired. Well, you better be fine, because I ain't carrying you anymore with that bite on your arm. Don't worry about... Ah, oh, shit!
do tell me that. That was what fucking happened. Does someone mind telling me what the fuck is going on? Now, hold on, Rebecca. You got me. Don't worry. I tell you, did anyone get a chance to ask her where she came from? For all we know, she could be working with Carver. She already told us that she and her friend were attacked. Then she was bitten by a dog. What? And you just believed her? You should have put her out of her misery right there. Dog bite my ass. I'm not worried. <gasps> Keep your finger off the trigger, boy. Whoa! What the fuck? You idiot! Every lurker for five miles probably heard You're the that. one telling me to fucking shoot her. Everybody just calm down for a second. Clementine, you okay? I'm not... I'm not working for anyone. Oh, I don't know what you're talking about. I just need help. We got a doctor right here, okay? He'll have a look. Now what the hell is wrong with you people? Okay, she's just scared. We're all scared, Luke. Don't act like we're the ones being irrational because we don't buy this bullshit story. No way she survived out here on her own. Why are we even arguing about this? Let me take a look. It's okay. Go ahead, he's a doctor. Damn, that must have hurt. Hmm, whatever it was, it got you good. This isn't how we do things, man. When you're bit, you get put down. End of story. I'm not going through this again. No one's suggesting that. We could take her arm off. <gasps> uh, I know that worked for a cousin down in Ainsworth. We could try that. It won't do any good. You'll just be making it worse for the girl. It's crazy. No one's going to volunteer to do that. I would. It mean saving her life. You're right. You shouldn't jump to any conclusions. You don't want to do something you're going to regret. Come on. She weighs about as much as a sack of flour. We can take her if it comes to that. Who's she? Sarah. What they say, stay inside. I don't mean to cause any trouble. I just wanted to find help. But if you let me go, I promise you'll never see me again. And where exactly would you go? To find help somewhere else if I can. Look, I don't know what the hell took a bite out of her, but still, she's just a kid. Worst case, she turns, and we can deal with it. So, what do you think? Was it a lurker? A bite like that? Could be anything. Only one way to find out. How? Oh. We wait. What? By tomorrow morning, if the fever set in, we'll know if she's gonna turn. In the meantime, we can lock her in the shed. What about my arm? It needs to get cleaned and, and stitched and bandaged. The girl is in bad shape, Carlos. We have all that stuff inside the cabin. We could probably get by with it. please. But, yeah, we can't do nothing. I'm not wasting supplies on a lurker bite. If it turns out you're telling the truth, I'll clean it and stitch it up for you in the morning. But... I'm sorry. It's the best we're gonna get. Finger off the trigger, son. I ain't your son. Don't be like that, man. It's alright. Boy's got his mom's temper. Come on. This is just a waste of time, you'll see. And when she turns, I ain't gonna be the one cleaning up the shed. It was a dog, you'll see. I guess we'll find out in the morning. If I last that long, maybe you could go look for it? I wish I could. I really do, but it's too risky. Sorry.
Why are we doing this? It's so fucking dumb. Because it's safer this way, and I'd rather be sure. Yeah, safer for who? <sighs> I can't believe this. Not much left in here. I guess if I have to, I can use this for stitches.